Hey, thanks for watching. This is an Overland gear review. And today we're reviewing the Claymore Ultra 2. Uh, unpackaging, not a review yet. I have not actually used this light yet, but I do plan on mounting it on my Overland trailer so that I can see in the dark when I'm cooking and setting up camp. This light retails for $102, although I did get it for a little less. Uh, Black Friday sale. Uh, it is a mountable light, so uh, I have a magnet that I purchased as well from Overland Addict uh, that screws in, and you'll see that later in the video. Um, or it can mount on anything with a quarter inch uh, socket. As you can see, it does come in a very solid, sturdy case for transportation. And this light uh, is one of the lesser expensive of the lights. I did look at some other models that were a little more expensive. The reviews on them were good, uh, but the next model up, there were quite a few comments that the light was actually overpowering. So I decided to get this, this one. And like I said, I haven't used it yet, but I will definitely let you know how it goes in a later, later uh, video. All right, so as we unpackage this, you can see it does have the function buttons on the back. Uh, the first one on the left there is a power button. And then the next one over is a dimming button. And then of course you have a uh, dim up and a dim down button. That's what those two are. Um, and then next to that is going to be the battery check lights, there's four of them to indicate the battery um, power level. And then the button that's on the right is the SOS button. You just hold that for two seconds and then that goes into the SOS blinking mode. And then click it one more time and it will shut off. Uh, it comes with a USB charging cord so you can plug that into your laptop or your um, portable charging device. Uh, like I mentioned, it does or uh, is capable of being attached to uh, something metal with this magnet here that I picked up. This magnet is uh, also able to be used for the other Claymore products such as the fan that a lot of people really love. Uh, this is my first Claymore product so um, I'm excited to see what all the fuss is about. I've heard some really good things about it. Uh, but on the back there, you're going to twist off the hook. Um, by the way, you can keep that hook on and just hang it from somewhere. You don't have to use this magnet, whatever works for your setup. But twist off that hook and then go ahead and screw in the magnet. And then uh, you're set. You're good to go. So on the back, as I mentioned before, uh, you'll find the ports for the USB charging. But in addition to that, you will also find the port for actually using this light as a charging device. So um, using the USB cable that's provided, you can actually charge uh, your phone or your iPad, which is a nice convenient feature. It is a quick charge, so that's pretty convenient. As far as the lantern itself goes, it is 1200 lumens and it does have three LED colors that you can change it up to. So warm, bright, and cool. And of course you can dim those or brighten those with those buttons on the back. Well guys, thanks so much for watching my unpackaging of the Claymore Ultra 2 lamp. I really appreciate you being here. If you got a second, if you could just subscribe to my channel 
or give me a thumbs up. I am at Minnesoverlander Adventures. And I've got more great reviews on gear coming up.